refuel, and now back to the energy lab. Oh. Alright, that was a good landing. Very good. High energy! You can't go in here unless you're you're hyped, you're super high energy. Let's go! Yeah. <laughs> you're too low energy, it just doesn't open, dude. Yeah, it just doesn't open. Which, you know, bad news for me as a generally <laughs> low energy <laughs> type of person. <laughs> <laughs> now you mention it, I'm pretty sure I would never get in either. <laughs> <laughs> and now, another fun episode of Let's Wait Till the Sand Fires Up. <laughs> Can you feel the high energy loop? High energy! <laughs> high energy! Let's go! Sand gameplay. Sand <laughs> waiting gameplay. There's no way to no. remove the cacti. There's no way to fly through the sand. We'll just wait. High energy! Dude, the more you talk about it, the more I think there's definitely a way to remove these cacti. <laughs> that should be, right? He just feels that they should. But I ain't fine. Do you want to try it. and fly through and tank the cacti? No, no, that's a terrible idea. I died last time I tried that. Oh, right, okay, you've already tried it, fair enough. But yeah, the more you think about it, like it feels like there should be a way to remove this cacti. So it's quicker on subsequent one through. Yeah, because this isn't exactly the height of gameplay. No, but there must be a reason they put this here, right? So that you only have a certain amount of time after you get through. Where are we trying to get to in this turn cave? Well, we don't know where we're trying to get to. It's a new area that we've not been to yet. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Maybe step back from the cactuses so you don't... I don't know, it's just, you know, the one thing I hate most in games are timers. Because the 20 minute timer this game is so liberal, I didn't mind much. But mm. the sand cave is now the, on the worst end of timers again. Because it does create a, a large, uh, a hefty timer, I want to say. Yeah. Go! Go, 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 go! Go, 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 go! High energy! High energy! High energy. What? Fly what? Up. There's nowhere to go! No. What? Come on, game! No! No, no you're kidding me! No, are we traps. We can get back, but come on! Come on, game! Oh, oh we're no, trapped! We no, we cannot! To your right? Oh, there would have been a path here! Shit! Oh fucking go, man, go! Go, 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 go! Uh, also, a dead end. No, 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 Oh god, that was oh, great. I can't get in there, that's Ghost Man anyway. Alright, that was some super high energy right there. That actually was kind of cool. <laughs> yeah, the sheer panic. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're outside. I guess the sand doesn't feel as well out here. Alright, cool, that means we have a bit more time here. Yeah, so you've not seen this before? No, I've never seen this before. Cool, cool. Alright, I'm gonna have that... to fly over there. Oh, my oxygen is also slowly running out. Yeah, yeah, I'm assuming we'll find ah, a tree of some kind. Ah, <gasps> ah. No, 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 no! Okay. Nope. Fucking. Alright, you just gotta. Just gotta slide in there. You gotta slide right in. <sighs> there we go. Trees detected! Yes! Alright, new area. Nothing in here. No, no, scrolls. Doesn't look like it. Alright, new area. Something. Here. Punch, scout? Where, where? Okay, cool. Let's open this. What does that do? Oh, it's a window. I mean... It's, it's a shitty window. Hmm. Yeah. 
All right, translate some writing. Record show no my arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the Whitehall station. Remy and I are devising an experiment to test if this is a real phenomenon. In theory, what we want to try to reproduce is a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering the black hole and exiting the white hole. Initial things first, our experiment setup will first pair a small black hole core with a small white hole core to mimic the setup on the white hole station. Hypothesis, it's, it's possible for an object to ex exit a white hole before entering the corresponding black hole. Well, it's like a multiply Whoa. myself? Yeah. There's more things to read. Let's, let's read that one as well. Put you here. Take that one. Oh, already holding scroll. Oop, put that away. Put that away. Pick that up. Put it in. What have you found, ancient scholars? <laughs> An update. An experiment here reproduced by anomalies and arrival and departure times. But Pi is unconvinced. It's more than an equipment error. I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to the unaided eye. To that end, we've decided to try adding more energy. I imagine a sunless city's energy supply should prove sufficient. Of note, Raimi, Yarrow requests that we let them know before we reroute energy to the experiment. All available energy has been rerouted from the city to our experiment. Raimi are about to run a new test. Hypothesis confirmed. Hypothesis confirmed. I saw it! I saw it! This is beyond extraordinary. This changes everything. A beautiful day for the intersection of abstract theory and practical application. Does that mean if you just am about to enter the black hole, and then you ex and then you quickly go out again? Do you sam do you theoretically copy your? Oh shit! This oh no! Wait, this is just that bit of sand. All right, I was scared for a second. Yeah, but no. I mean, if you if you're exiting the white hole after you're entering before entering the black hole. Then yeah, then there's two of you. Yeah, for, one for like a very small period of time. So it, here's the thing. So generally though, the thing with black holes is that there's an event horizon that once you cross, you can't come back. Yeah. All right. The Sovereign Observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is, is possible to have something arrive 22 minutes before it's actually sent through the warp. If learned, the ne uh, negative interval of time between departure and arrival can be increased by adding more energy to the warp core. Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increases at an exponential rate. See, but this is means that means for 22 minutes, there are two versions of that thing. Yeah. By creating a 22 minute long interval is possible, so, but we're currently unable to generate the power necessary. The energy is currently unavailable, you say. Raymond, I believe it would be necessary to invent a new method of producing energy. A thrilling but enormous undertaking. It would also require advanced warp technology able to handle such energy. It would also like need an enormous space to fit these proposed energy and warp technologies together. Is that? The only large enough would be the Ash Twin. Does that mean this is what we have to do? <laughs> right? Well, yeah, because you, the, time frame, of you... the reset time is 22 minutes, right? It's a... Yeah! <laughs> so oh god, have... so you'd have two of you for a run! No, There's I don't think I don't think that's the case. No, but we have to, we uh, we have to. What is it? We have to uh, create a larger amount of energy so the re uh, the the setting is larger than twenty two minutes, so we can re resume a normal life. Is what I'm oh. saying. Maybe I don't know. Well, because I assume it re like even right. if you can do that, doesn't the meteor still kill everyone? Well, no, the, there's no meteor that kills anyone. The sun explodes. Oh, the sun explodes. <laughs> the Ash Twin project will be one of our biggest undertaking. To build it, we need a way to travel quickly between Ash Twin and each location that holds crucial project materials. We also used warp towers to connect Ash Twin to each creation. Each tower on Ash Twin will warp to a different planet. My gratitude to these who noted my impressive language. The sun is not a planet. We've, we are on the Ash Twin, aren't we? Or are we on the this Amber the Twin? Ash. I think we're on the oh. Amber Twin. But I've not I've been to the Ash Twin and it's very hard to find these points. We can assign each tower to visually reflect its warp destination. The Giant Seep Tower, for instance, could resemble a cyclone. Alright, alright. And I can begin work on this immediately in the black hole forge. Alright. Ship lock updated. I bet it has. I bet it has. <laughs> So these are the six towers that are being built. Yeah. The problem is I've not seen these towers. Did 
This door will need to remain closed. The high energy lab is not being used to design the... If you're here to help, be sure to use the sun the city path to the lab. Yeah, this this is where I came from, actually. This is like, oh shit, I can't can't enter here, I think. I, th I think that was it. The Sunless City, 300 meters. Huh, wait. 300, that seems really close. Well, I'm assuming the Sunless City is through where we just came, right? I assume That's where we, we were about. is the Sunless City, right? Because yeah. It's City build underground. It seems pretty sunless. But it, that's, to me. yeah, but that yeah, that sign is three hundred meters. I guess it could have been three hundred meters travel. So let's go. Let's go there. See where we end up, right? Because this says, "Oh, it's on a city, but it's ghost mare, which instantly kills us." I see. Crash side caves. Let's go to the crash side caves. Well, really, I'm just looping back to my ship. This, I don't see any crash. I guess, I mean, where I am is the crash side caves. So really, oh, yeah. we need to not a reset to now find this anglerfish cave. And then yeah. at some point, I would still like to be able to find this area in the other twin that has all these Nomai statues, right? Hmm. Shit's damaged. I don't really care. <laughs> Like, if you look at this, this still says every memory recorded by Nomai statues transmitted to a corresponding storage unit within the Ash Twin, which is where I oh. want to get to. This is where this whole fucking finding the city and whatnot started. But I've still not found this goddamn area. Yeah. It's a sign for each of the Ash Twin. I've, also, I've been on the Ash Twin for a bit, and the promise of Sandstorm makes it nearly impossible to see anything. Right, really? let's just... Uh, for the end of this, let's... Uh, we'll get back to the Stepping Stone Cave. But let's fly to the Ash Twin, right? This is the Ember Twin. Okay, yeah, this is the other. I think, at least. So that is the Ash Twin. Yes, yes it is. Wait, these areas have not been there before, excuse me. <laughs> um, I've been on this planet. This has not been here before. Is this what it looks like after it fills with sand? Maybe if they're most of the sand turns through to the other side, these things become available? I've been oh, here before. <laughs> this is not what it looked like at whatsoever. Well, we should explore them, right? Before the uh, sun explodes. Yeah. Oh, vital's low. Are they still low? No, they're good. Yeah, see, that's the issue. <laughs> yeah. Run! That works! That Ooh. works! That works! Oh! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Like a... Ow! <laughs> You're oh, alive! Landed. Not dead. <laughs> Let's go into this tower. This puzzle. Oh, oxygen. So this is the warp tower to my area. How do I, I don't know how to use a warp tower is the problem. Mm. I feel like it's been set at some point, but... I mean, I just don't see an interface here that makes me able to activate it. Oh, the sun's not looking to go too hot. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> uh. Oh, and not our, not our one of these guys. Excuse me, let me just walk around your corpse. How do I how do I activate this? Do I just stand in it? Uh, well, no, clearly not. Oh yes. Oh. Yeah. Wait, no, this is the sand. Oh. <laughs> I was so excited for a second. Yeah. And now I'm just drifting in space. <laughs> Fuck 
<laughs> Fuck the sand. I'm on the wrong planet again now. And oh, we're alive. I can't, how am I supposed to fly back there, you game? There's, there's no way I can fly there with my regular human boost. Well, like, not really human, but my, my regular technology boost. And Go. regular alien Go. 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 Oh, oh I guess oh, you can. Oh. Like, it, that's actually pretty doable. Yeah. Now, make Although, I don't know how you're going to land and live. That works. That works. Uh, uh, oh, I think you're gonna uh, donk into this tower, dude. Oh, I think I'm gonna dunk into this tower. I think you're gonna oh. dunk. Oh, I think you're gonna dunk. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> good dunk. Yeah, good dunk. Some time has passed since I checked in with you. How are the sun station plans? Presently, my assessment is that our plan will either fail or succeed. But I don't find that funny. A curious uh, ring fix. I'm a gas. And see what the state of matter you are has to do with this, and I don't recall supporting the sun station's construction. Time spent away from the station would be beneficial to you both. I'm immensely interested in testing your hypothesis that at least we can agree on. Like, I. It does feel like there should be a way at some point to remove this shit. Because there's so much of it. It really does. But it is, yeah. Look, the there's less and less of a core here, so the sand's piling up on the other planet. Oh, so as it fills up on that planet, this oh, it's coming in. again! It's coming again! Run! Oh, it goes back and forth. No, it just goes straight around. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna hide here because if it picks me up now, it's gonna make me crash into the other part of this planet. Boy, am I smart. <laughs> ooh, ooh. And we're fine. Hey, yo, I'm so good. We do oh, have to go up there, though. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad you think you're good, because next we're going to try and do some black hole parkouring. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that. Now, for... <laughs> There's two more things I need to do in the city. One is fly yeah. to some weird eye thing, and the other one is find the anglerfish stepping stone cave uh, entrance. Still want to know how to activate these things, though. Like I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I just don't. Not sure. Not sure that's information that I, I might have found, but I feel like that's very vital information that, and that should be a lot easier to accomplish, you know? Yeah. So I am listening to what you're saying, but I really am just watching the sun, waiting for it to explode. <laughs> yeah, it's like, how, but how do I activate oh, this? Look, you're standing on it, it's doing something, isn't it? No, it's not or is that just a graphic? It's not. This is just. This consistently happens. I can't activate uh -oh. this in any capacity. So I don't know. I don't know how to how to <laughs> deal with it. Mm. You want to? Did you not see the sun explode when you watched the other thing? Well, no. It's like the universe ended, and it was just happening every twenty minutes. And I thought it was just like a giant like, meteor. That was like so gigantic, it wiped everything out. Oh, those are the quantum things, right? No, no, they're not quantum here. But I want to read this message quick before we go boom boom. A first livery, one warp core. My gratitude with the Ashton Project on the way. I confess my curious about what you say and poke fun. I command you to do our station is the mall for the towers being built. Was more precise, it would be this to the whole station with you. I'm happy to explain your findings. We should wait here. Stop using the scroll while to flirt with my sister. Okay. This has updated our log. Alright. Now let's 
go outside so you can see the sun exploding. We could not be closer to this. We've got front row seats, bro. <laughs> All right. The end of the universe. What a spectacle. <laughs> well, it's really just this galaxy, this uh, solar system, but still, what a spectacle. It should happen relatively soon, right? This recording's been 20 minutes, and we spent the beginning of this getting here. Yeah. I mean, we can keep exploring, I guess, but I don't know what else there is to explore. Yeah, I mean... I've been to most of these towers. No, 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 sun! Sun! <laughs> we want to see you! There it is. Oh, this is... <laughs> look how close it is to, to dying. Oh, yeah, it's released all of the sand that was once in this planet is over there now. Look at that. Yeah. Let's fly a lot. Let's fly that into the sun. That, that'll go over well. Is your camera affected by gravity? It should be, right? So it's just gonna keep going into the sun? I feel like it should just die because it's... it's yeah, emergency sun. recall activated because it died <laughs> of heat uh. stroke. As anything does. Ah, it's gonna come around in a second here. Yeah, I, I never mind that the time constraint with the, you know, the reset, because that's not only the core principle of the game, it's also yeah. a lot, large amount of time. The sand mm. one I minded slightly more, because it felt more constricting. Yeah. Well, I mean, even with the sand one, there's still more you have to do, right? Yeah, Wasn't there a cave? Yeah, the, there's find? a cave I want to find, and the weird thing I need to fly to, but I might die several times doing so. Because there yeah. is ghost matter. Oh, 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 Ooh. look at that. Look at oh, that. Oh, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Bwah. There it is. Oh. Ooh. And. <laughs> Cut. 